Saying that a series like Solar Opposites has surprises is like stating that Looney Tunes needs a spoiler alert. This is a series where the main characters are one slaughtered, one another, went through three reincarnations, and then split off again into their original alien forms. The finale of season 3 was too bland, so will it be the end of the show? The finale of season 3 jumps forward 6 months, leaving Yumulak and Jesse attending school without even any sci-fi details or thrills, and Terry and Corvo working soul-crushing professional jobs, but the Poopa is still happy. It reads, I love Moana and I love you guys. What does this mean for Solar Opposites going forward? Will it return? Will it retcon this movie and discard it all to get back to the amazing sci-fi stuff? Or will it genuinely pursue this plot line? The series' co-creators, directors, Mike McMahon and Josh Brysel firmly stated that they're pursuing this new development when contacted by Movie Web. In this video, we're going to talk about Season 4 of the TV show. Keep watching whether there'll be a Season 4 of the, of the Solar Opposites or not. Will there be a Season 4 of the Solar Opposites? The good news is that the Solar Opposites was already extended for a fourth season by Hulu, who also gave the show an early renewal. The show's fourth season was reported to be 12 episodes long back in June 2021, along with the news that it had been renewed. So fans will see the main characters of the series with sci-fi gadgets, lethal incidents occurring, and other news. When will season 3 of Solar Opposites be released? You shouldn't anticipate these unexpected shocks and alterations for another year, because season 4 is virtually finished writing, but as McMahon adds, it costs us a year to animate. In the interim, season 3 of Solar Opposites is currently available to stream on Hulu, so we can expect the release of Solar Opposites in 2023. What is the interesting storyline of the Solar Opposites? The show, which was co-created by Mike McMahon and Justin Roiland, one of the minds behind Rick and Morty features a number of extraterrestrials who fall and land on Earth after their native planet is obliterated. 